For the past few years, fans of the Fallout series have been clamoring for a remaster or a complete remake of Fallout 3. At the time of this recording, Fallout 3 is nearly 15 years old, which makes me feel some type of way for sure. Bethesda has turned a deaf ear to these cries from fans, either being too busy with current projects or simply uninterested in remastering anything but Skyrim. So this topic has remained a dream for many a Fallout fan, staying in the back of their mind in the wouldn't it be nice category of their thoughts. However, some fans took this dream a step further and simply put in the work themselves. Where Bethesda couldn't put in their time, these modders stepped up to the plate. For years, Fallout fans would hear rumors of various projects that promised to remake most of the Fallout games from the past. Still, recently, we have been getting more and more access to these projects. One such group putting in the hard work to make these dreams a reality is the Capital Wasteland team, a dedicated set of Fallout fans that want to experience Fallout 3 with the improvements in visuals and gameplay that Fallout 4 offers and they remade everything from the Fallout 3 Point Lookout DLC from scratch in Fallout 4. The Point Lookout DLC for Fallout 3 is one of the best examples of what downloadable content can be. In fact, the Fallout series has a decent list of DLCs that show the pinnacle of what can be done with additional content. The DLC takes us to Point Lookout, a swampland that the bombs of the Great War missed. While this leaves us with a more intact world space to explore, the locals make the adventure much more horrifying, if not because of appearance alone, and their cult-like behaviors keep most outsiders away. Eventually, the Lone Wanderer will have to choose between an old ghoul named Desmond or the brain of Professor Calvert, shaping the area for years to come. Point Lookout was a phenomenal DLC, and the world space fits perfectly into the Fallout universe. The murky swamplands act as a great backdrop to the more nefarious actions taking place behind the scenes. With all of that said, it makes sense that fans would want to play a remaster of not only Fallout 3, but of this wonderful DLC as well. So after years of work, the Capital Wasteland project has brought us just that. If you have Fallout 4 on the PC, along with all of the DLCs, you can download this 4GB mod and relive Point Lookout in a way you never thought you would, completely remastered in Fallout 4. While I don't want to spoil much in this video for people who want to play it for themselves, or people who have never played Point Lookout, I do want to share my experience with the mod and my overall thoughts on what is offered. One thing to note about the Point Lookout mod for Fallout 4 is that it's designed to take place during the events of Fallout 4, so some things have been changed, especially in the main quest, to make it relate more to the Commonwealth. This is more about characters talking about the Commonwealth instead of the Capital Wasteland, or being sent to the Dunwich Borers during the Black Hall quest instead of the Dunwich Building little things to help Point Lookout fit into the world of Fallout 4. Other than that, the Capital Wasteland team spared no expense regarding the details of the DLC. After playing through the mod twice and exploring heavily, I have yet to find something out of place. This mod team painstakingly remade every detail of Point Lookout, and it's remarkable. The Swamp Folk look so good in the updated Fallout 4 engine, and they are just as bullet spongy as they were in the original DLC. Seeing them hobble in the distance through the fog and the shadows is just as unsettling as when we first experienced it in Fallout 3. The updated combat in Fallout 4 makes fighting them feel fresh again. Even things like well-hidden easter eggs are present in this incredibly faithful remake. When playing this, you really get a sense that the people who worked on it truly loved what they were doing. The care shown to the most minor details of Point Lookout speaks volumes about the team's dedication to the project. When it comes to quests, this mod pulls things off that I personally didn't think they would be able to do. The trip to the Mother Punga Fruit is intact and is faithful to its origins, with some nice twists that bring it into the Fallout 4 game space. No stone was left unturned when remaking Point Lookout for Fallout 4, and this passion project speaks for itself. The link to the mod can be found in the description below, and I highly recommend anyone with a copy of Fallout 4 for the PC to download it right away. It's awesome that the modding community for Fallout is so dedicated that things most thought would never happen are showcased better than expected. This mod is proof that Fallout 3 badly needs a remaster. We can only hope for the Capital Wasteland team to continue their outstanding work with the rest of the game. At the time of this recording, Bethesda has actually hired a couple of people from this team as well as other modding projects due to their fantastic work on these types of assignments, though many are now working on Fallout 76, 
which can be a bittersweet situation for sure. I still have hope that Bethesda will issue remasters of the classic Fallout games as well as Fallout 3 and New Vegas. Still, having something like this that even gives us a taste of what that could be like is great, and I thank the modders for their hard work on such a large undertaking. In my own opinion, Bethesda would be wise to hire all of these modders to remaster Fallout 3. The team has shown without a shadow of a doubt that they can keep it faithful to the original work while improving the experience in nearly every other way possible. This is a mod you don't want to ignore. It shows what's really possible with modding in Fallout games, and the attention to detail is off the charts. This is a great way to get a taste of Fallout 3 Remastered, and it goes without saying, the Fallout 4 Point Lookout mod is magnificent. Uh, I gotta testify, come up in the spot looking extra fly, for the day you die, you gon' trust the sky, you gon' trust the sky, baby girl, testify, come up in the spot looking extra fly, for the day you die, you gon'